Where did they all come from? Good morning, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton. I am your humble narrator. Welcome back to Project Zomboid. I'm going to head to my, uh, my secret fishing hut today. And I made some, uh, fishing, fishing traps yesterday. And I also got some, uh, some more goodies to make explosives, hopefully. I got a pipe, which I think I just need to combine with gunpowder and some twine. And then that's gonna be an awesome pipe bomb. But I also used up my smoke bomb, so maybe uh, I'll keep an eye out for a cold pack and some newspaper. So we can make another smoke bomb. Either way, it's gonna be just uh, a fantastic day. As it always is around here, in Dayton's neighborhood. It used to have another name, West Point, or some shit like that, but... Now it's Dayton's neighborhood. Only Dayton's neighborhood. The zombies aren't smart enough to uh, protest that fact. So good. Is it raining a little? Yes, it's raining just a little. Let's see how that uh, that flaming house is going. Hmm. I do want to go to my uh, my shack, but I have a bath towel now, so if I get a little wet, I can I can just dry myself off. Hmm. Is that the house? I think the the last one on the block. It's still standing. How is it still standing? I've done everything to this house. I hate it so much. It's never going to let me get any peace. I need to find some peace. Been a lot of Weezer references in these uh these past couple episodes or not a lot, but more than usual, definitely. It's been upped at least uh 200% considering I've mentioned Weezer zero times in the previous uh, parts of this fucking series. Anyhow, anyways, anywho, I got some rope. I got some rope and I got a flashlight, so I'm going to unpack these. I'll break apart some, uh, some of these wood crates that I got, and then I should be able to build another... another light stand? What do they call it? I'm gonna look on this thing. Another lamp on pillar. Yeah, that's what they call it. <laughs> that's a... Uh, mm-hmm. Those are certainly some words. Alright. So which way does it go? This way. And I'll build it right here. So we can get, like, some omnidirectional shit going on. Or dual directional shit, I guess it would be. I'll turn it off for now. We're doing a great thing. It's coming together. Oh, I should also plant some zucchini seeds while I'm here. Before I go up and offload a bunch of this shit. Hey, how's it going? Hey, paisanos! Let's see, info. These are thirsty. And they are sickly. So that means you should probably plant some more, right? Right. <laughs> I, I could come out here and water them. I guess that would be a good idea. Ah... Uh, Pain in my butt. I tell you what. I know I got a watering can up there somewhere. So it might be a farming type of episode. But that's fine. I think the, the better your farming is, the quicker you grow stuff. Which seems like a smart idea to me. But I'm not a smart man. I, I know what love is. Alright, let's see. We can get rid of the box of MREs. The pipe. The glues. I'll put those fishing net traps out uh, do I have enough nails probably 80 is somewhere near enough oh god I'm gonna lose these for sure all right just put them in there next to the other boxes okay it's gonna be great fantastic a little bit of thread a little bit of twine a lot of bit of wire mmm he seems to like that wire quite a bit but twine is the the rare part so I should have been picking that up all along. I'm sure I do have some more in here so I can make some more fishing traps, but I've only broken one so far. So it doesn't seem like that big of a deal. Put some of my ammos. Advanced cooking I still need to read. Alarm clock might come in handy. Is that an extra baseball bat? I think it is. Is it in better condition than the one I have currently? I think it is. Alright. Well, get that shit out. Pull that out and put this one away. And then I got planks, ropes, wooden crates, water bottles, 
Hmm. It's a lot of crap that I don't know if I need, to be quite honest. But I just pick it up because because I got space for it. I got a lot of space. Don't worry. Don't worry about all that. Axe? Should I should I repair this? Craft bindle using planks? What the fuck? You got like a, a sack of shit on one end and then the axe on the other? That's really weird. That's really weird, bro. I had some wood glue. I'm gonna take this wood glue. I'm gonna repair my axe. Seems like a good idea. Potentially repairs 70%. That seems like a good deal to me. Do it. Do it now! It doesn't want to do it. I gotta unpack it. I guess that's how it works. I don't know. I don't know anything anymore. Bam. Oh yeah, that's looking pretty good. That's looking pretty good there, isn't it? And I used up one of my wood glues. Shit! No, it's fine. It doesn't really matter, does it? Take these uh, nails back out. Now I got 101. I could box them up, but I ain't gonna. Got two aluminum foils, one hairspray. I will need to keep an eye out for these things. Um, Trowel? Hmm. I don't know if you are needed at the moment, Trowel. I'm just trying to offload as much as I can. Or as much as is feasible, because I could just uh, empty this whole thing in there, but that probably wouldn't be a good idea now, would it? Um, I'll take these net traps out. And we're relatively, uh, low on the loot totem pole there. I think everything's going fine. Let's check these traps. How am I exerted already? You guys, holy shit, you guys. Check it. Check it, dog. Got four fishes. Hmm. And I'm hoping that these are not going to break. But you don't really know. I'm supposed to take them out of the water after 15 hours. I have not been doing that. Oh, dang. There was a bunch in that one. We got 10 fishes in one of those. Hmm. Oh. You hungry? Eat some of this fish. It's really good. I like it a lot. So many traps to check. But that's uh, not a bad problem to have, I think. Mmm. Oh, yes. And I'll place uh, an extra fishing net. Because it doesn't seem like they break after a certain amount of time in the water. I think it's just a rumor, dude. It's like when you're a little kid and you tell your friends you turn the video games upside down and you get the Mario and uh, he turns into Yoshi or something in the Pokemon games. You know what I'm talking about? If you don't, then you had better friends than I did. <laughs> That's why the missing no glitch was like such a big deal. People were like, holy shit, dude. A glitch that actually works after a million years where the internet kind of sucked and uh, we had to believe what other people said. But people would pass around all kinds of glitches as fact and uh, they weren't actually fact. Not at all. And then I got my campfire out back here and I still can't figure out how to light this shit up. Oh, add fuel. I just need a book. I just need a book to put in there. Of course. I dropped a book somewhere around here. Cooking for intermediates. Yes. That's nice. I, I guess this is how it works. I don't really know. Add some fuel. There you go. Cooking for intermediates. And then you add some more like planks and shit to it. Light fire, advanced cooking plus lighter. Okay! That's that's how you do that. So I don't really need to, to light the fire right now. Kick the fires, light the tires, or something like that. <laughs> I think it's light the fires, kick the tires. But I ain't no scientist. Don't depend on me for nothing. Look at, look at, you just standing out here, enjoying the view? Is that how that's going? Get down! Nobody's allowed to be out here. This is Dayton's secret hideaway. Don't you understand? They don't. They never understand. I wonder if my uh, blunt accuracy is getting better. Obviously it is, but not quite enough. Hmm. 
I would like to get it up to like seven or eight, like my carpentry. But I spent so much time carpentering and not enough time kicking ass! <laughs> We're doing pretty good on it though. It'll get there. Just gotta not die and it'll get there. I swear I've killed like 800 zombies or some crazy shit like that. I should probably take some beta blockers because I do notice myself getting a little paranoid. Even when the zombies haven't noticed me quite yet. So, uh, take some peels. Peels! 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 Peels here! Peels here! Bill! Peel! Bill! Peel! Left 4 Dead 2 spam. Voice spam shit. I kinda miss Left 4 Dead 2. That was some nice zombie killing action, especially in the versus mode. Holy shit. That was tasty. But, um, yeah. The time has passed. The time has passed. It's been many a years, and uh, we're never gonna see Half-Life 3, we're never gonna see Left 4 Dead 3. I think uh, Valve just has a problem. They have a little problem with uh, with the third iteration. They can't make a trilogy for some reason that I, I don't really understand. There's lots of cool map packs and shit. There's lots of cool add-ons for Project Zomboid, come to think of it. Hydrocraft is one of them, which is why I can craft uh, bunny cages and all kinds of weird shit. But, uh, yeah, I don't fuck with it too much, for obvious reasons. It gets me all confuzzled. See? I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Really, I'm looking for hairspray and aluminum and sparklers. But I don't know where to find any sparklers! <laughs> I'd hate to just resort to, uh, spawning them in for myself. But I, I might. I'm not beyond that. I'm not too good. I was inches from spawning a needle, uh, before I found one in my base so I don't know it's not it's not completely off the table but I'm not gonna jump to do it either that's a mistake I think hmm steel BBs steel shears steel hammer wow you can make a lot of steel things huh well here's some more aluminum motion sensor pipe oh wow this is quite a quite a little stash of electronic goods that they have here. Hmm. Crafted timer. I guess that's so uh, you can strap it on a bomb and have it go off a little bit later. That makes good sense. I'll take the aluminum. I don't really know what to do with the rest of this. Oh, make remote trigger, add crafted trigger. Yes, this is what I want. Unlock some new recipes for me. How nice of you. Oh, and this one. Add motion sensors. Oh my god, you can make a motion sensor bomb? That is fucking awesome. Well, I'm glad I read both of these then. It's odd that they stack on top of one another. That doesn't seem right to me. Uh, where's my screwdriver? Do I keep that in my main inventory? No. It's been hiding in the doctor's bag. I want to try and do some, uh, some things with this electronic scrap, but it doesn't seem to want to let me. Hmm. Perhaps I'll just shut myself in this room. Sparklers? Sparklers? No. Solder and super glue. I'm going to read my cooking book, and I'm going to try and figure out what the fuck. What the fuck I'm doing! <laughs> Because I really need to know how to make a bomb. An Arcus Cook book. Here we go. Electrical. Dismantle electronic scrap. There's a small flashlight I could dismantle. Add motion sensor. Aerosol bomb. That should be like right near the top, shouldn't it? A. E. Flame trap. Oh my god. What the fuck is all this stuff? Amplifier dismantle gives you a, a a speaker thing. Dismantle a speaker gives you an amplifier. Yeah, that's what I want to say. Dismantle laser pointer, toaster, all this shit will give you electronic scrap. Dismantle microwave gives you a broken microwave. <laughs> Helpful! Uh, dismantle treadmill gives you a steel pipe and a broken treadmill, but you need pliers to do it. Hmm. Interesting. Make dead battery? Uh, I don't think that's good. Charging unit. What? Uh-oh. Lady screaming. 
Why is the lady screaming? Electronic scrap screwdriver, TV remote and glue makes a remote controller. Remote trigger takes receiver, couple electronics and some glue. Can make a crafted timer from glue and electronic scrap and an alarm clock or timer. Huh. I want to make an aerosol bomb. Can I make an aerosol bomb? That's that's the thing that I'm trying to make. Flame trap. Flame trap! I know this fucking thing doesn't work. Ugh. How frustrating. How fucking frustrating can you get? Flame trap. Look at how awesome it would be to shoot fire everywhere. I wouldn't have to rely on the fucking stove to burn the house down. I could just burn the house down. Throw a flame trap in there. What the fuck ever. Alright, fast forward this a little more. I want to get to uh, 50. There we go. Well done. Pack this away. And I guess uh, nobody got in here because of the lady screaming. I don't think she was screaming near my house. I think it was down the way just a, l a little bit. Uh, we'll eat some donuts. Oh, and I have all these bait fish too. I do hear a zombie groaning somewhere. Oh, there. Hello, buddy. How are you doing, friend? Wonderful to see you. And dead. And dead. And dead! Hmm. I wonder where the screaming was from. Not from somewhere near my base, I do hope. We've been through here, got a trash bag and shit. Oh, there's just not enough time in the day, let me tell you. Hmm, well. Those are those garages that I searched already. Hey, buddy. Coming to get me? Can't get me. Too fast, can't get me. <laughs> And then, the less bodies there are, that's kind of how I quantify. <laughs> have I been up this way before? Well, sort of. A little bit I have. Oh, what's in this, uh, this roadside trash can? Surely something good. Doll, empty bottle, tin can. <gasps> Some little girl lost her doll. That's so sad. Bonk. Ha ha ha. Get him. Get him good. You got an energy bar? I'll take that. Hmm. It's probably not healthy to eat energy bars from corpses. <laughs> but I don't set these boundaries for myself, alright? I ain't gonna listen to what nobody else tells me. I'll take some garbage bags. Rain collector's always good. Can't go wrong with that. I think that's a grocery store? No. This is the school. This is the school that I was in before. It has a quite, quite a large library, which I should probably look into just a little bit. I didn't explore this place too much because I was full of, full of crap. Well, I'm always full of crap, but <laughs> I was even more full of crap than usual. Hmm, comic book. I like comic books. Ah, it's, it's, there's just so much stuff. Could I find a cold pack? Hmm, cold pack. Yes, that would be a good idea. Apiculture. Ooh, can make uh, some bee houses. Was that? Hive. <laughs> bee house. <laughs> it's not even that funny, but I thought it was, it was quite hilarious. Because my brain is slowly, slowly leaving me. <laughs> oh, electrical for intermediates. I think I am at the three to four level skill. Electrical. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. I bring with me. Sure. Why not? Got so many fucking books to read anyways. Water tower, water pump. Hmm. I should probably make that bring the uh, electricity back to the town. Or at least the plumbing. I still don't know how to do the electricity shit. But I bet there's a book for that as well. Maybe. It's possible. Master first aid. Hmm. Hmm. Just not finding what I want in here. Ah ha ha. Adult magazine. Never mind. Found what I wanted. <laughs> it's an aluminum working tech textbook. Uh oh. Don't get the hiccups. That's gonna be bad. 
Hmm. Carpentry, cooking. I don't think I need any of this. What's my farming at? Hmm, it's pretty high. I need the uh, intermediate farming, I think. Does that make sense? Maybe so. Maybe so. And I still don't know shit about trapping. Only fishing. Ah. I'd like to be able to build just one trap. That would uh, greatly please me. It's another advanced cooking book. Hmm. Oh, and a little hot now. Okay. Well, pack the sweater up. So hot. Ugh. It's a library, okay? All the hot stuff happens in here. Let's dismantle some radios. How's that? Electronics wire, some scrap, aluminum, amplifier. Well, that's helpful. A light bulb. Radio receiver. I don't know what to do with all this stuff anymore. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just wanted to see if I could take it apart. And guess what? I could. And they're like, that's great. Now put it back together. And I'm like, uh... <laughs> I don't know how to put it back together. Hmm, advanced electrical. I guess I'll take that as well. I don't know what the electrical skill does. It doesn't seem to do much at all. Ooh, candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Some garbage bags. That's always nice. I like this school. This is a nice little school. This is way better than my school. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. Saw a flashlight. Gimme. And there's also a dead rat. But that's okay. Doesn't affect the flashlight. <laughs> oh. And uh, some delicious treats in here. Yes. I eat beef jerky. Keeps me strong. Ah! I heard a, a banging around somewhere. So I'll need to be careful. Quite carefully. Keep grabbing up the jars with lids. Doesn't seem like such a bad idea. Anybody in here? No? Wonderful. I've got seven garbage bags. Hmm. Pat, post notes, papers, sheet of paper. Yeah, that's about what I expected to find in here. I think this is the one with the, uh,. Oh, he's not banging. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Please lay down. Please die now. Okay. I think this is the nurse's station. My goodness. Got me a little worried there, fellas. I thought that was the end. And it really could be over that fucking quick. Ugh. Oh, deep breath. We made it. Somehow. Metal detector. Ooh. I really need to learn some stuff about all this. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It would help me out a lot, I do believe. Oh, and now I'm now I'm overweighted? How's that? How am I overweighted? Oh, bait fish. Bait fish is why. Is that bitch knocking on that door? How many times I tell you, bitch? Occupado! I'm gonna come over there. I'm gonna come over there, and I'll show you what for. Hello! Lovely to see you. Please lay down and die. Thank you so much. Oh, chewing gum. Mmm. Love chewing gum. And I guess the dude is still banging around. Oh! Here we are. Other parts of classroom. Pop up, pop up. That's right. That's what you get, isn't it? Hmm. Doesn't seem to be much in here. Comic book computer keyboard. Yay! You took that from a little kid, didn't you? I hope you're proud of yourself. Ooh, box of MREs. Yes, every fucking time. Yes. Another flashlight. Get some nails. Push broom, small flashlight. Wood glue, wood crate. I take. I take. I make more light. Hmm. 
And here's an MRE you could eat right now. Because it's ready to eat. It's a meal, and it's ready to eat. Hmm, that's a pretty good batch, Ray. Animal cage? Can I make a trap from this? I don't know. I'm bringing it with me. Hmm, look, we caught a dead rat. <laughs> Just kidding. It was already in there. Good joke, though. Good joke, though. <laughs> Take a couple batteries. Hmm. Pack of chewing gum. Oh, I got 20 sticks of chewing gum. Yes, I'll just eat them. Eat them like candy. Oh, and I can have a drink here, too. Mmm, wondrous day. There's nothing else in here. I checked the other classroom. Hey, Bo. Can't be doing that. How many times to tell you? Well, just once. But I told the other guy, and I'm pretty sure you overheard me. Maybe. Possibly. Is there anything in here? Yes, there is. Thumbtack, rubber cement. God damn. What a useless place this is. <laughs> There's another box of nails. I like that. I'd like some sparklers. Snakes and sparklers. Mm. <laughs> oh, man. I guess my doctor bag's filled up. I can't fit that crate in there. Damn! Damn, damn, damn! Uh, one more garbage bag. Anybody got another garbage bag for me? Nope. Okay! Thanks so much for that. There's so many classrooms. This is quite a place to explore. This is not a classroom. It's, uh, the room of stink. And another room of stink! Damn it! How many rooms of stink do you have in this school? Two. Uh, one for girls and one for boys. Oh my god, there's stuff in the desks. I didn't realize that at all. I guess I should have. But it's not things that I'm looking for in the desk. Ooh, here's another, uh, another flashlight. Flashlights and ropes. We're gonna make a bunch of, uh, weird things. <laughs> We're gonna do some weird stuff. I hope you're ready for that. Um... Another rope. I take. Please fit. I take. Hmm. Jar with lid. Cannot fit. Point three pounds. Hmm. Hmm. I, I grab one of these. I don't want to start on another rain collector. That'll be fine. We can make three with that. And I should uh, probably head home. Because it's five o'clock. And my mom's gonna yell at me if the street lights come on and I ain't back home. And I'm carrying uh, a bit too much shit now. But I don't know what else I could fit in my... in my baggy bag. Oh, Yeah, it's about as full up as it'll get. I could eat chewing gum. Because these are fucking giant pieces of chewing gum. Mmm. Oh, that's nice. I like that. Hey, you! What you doing outside the green grocer? Green grocer. Now you're grocer too. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. I'm gonna write that one down. Dang. All sorts of bitches out on this road. I need to get past that green grocer someday. We'll have to set straight out. Oh my god. Yep. There's uh, quite a few baddies around here. Baddies and fatties. Soup, soup, soup. I ain't gonna fuck with it. Where did they all come from? God damn it! I thought I'd just clean this neighborhood up. Perhaps it's uh, a part that I've not been to yet. That's also com completely possible. It seems like it. A little cul-de-sac over there. Oh my god. There's even more. They just don't stop! What the fuck? Oh, chewing gum gets rid of unhappiness. I should probably save those for that purpose. Hmm. Good thinking. Great thinking, Dayton! We're so proud of you! Nobody's here to, to compliment me, so I, I guess I just have to compliment myself now. I'm very sad. Hmm. 
We got uh, two flashlights, at least in that bag. Three flashlights, two ropes. Hmm. So I could probably only craft uh, a couple of those. Lamp post with lamps, that's what they're called. I don't know anything anymore. Moderate exertion, come on. You could take it. You could do it. You're the fucking superstar, aren't you? Aren't you the superstar? I bet he is. He's the track and field star. He didn't know it before, but all of a sudden. Killed 850 zombies. Yeah! Yeah, boy! Fucking doing the shit out of this. I would like to be home. But we're not gonna make it. Not quite yet. Maybe I could just, uh... Find a little, a little place to lay down. Wouldn't that be nice? Um... Okay, here's where I lay down. Close curtains. I really hope that we don't die tonight. <laughs> so friends, this has been Project Zomboid. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this episode, please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe. And if you do, friends, I'll send you a pack of cigarettes. They're, they're going up $2 uh, thanks to Prop 56 in California. So that's just wonderful. That's going to happen in April. And uh, I'm a little miffed about it, but not really. Uh, but if I do want to smoke some cigarettes, it it seems like a shitty thing to do. But California knows best. Trust me on that. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks again for watching. And until then, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you. My friends